Hi, this is Michael VK5ZEA from Port Lincoln in South Australia and I thought I'd show you what I've been up to with the VK5 REXC 2 meter D-Star repeater the home brew one which has featured in a number of my other videos I've had it out uh, from the repeater site for the last week and I've been doing some uh, some tidying up and generally getting it to a stage where I would be comfortable for other people to look at it. A um, couple of things I've done. I've uh, installed some chassis mount end connectors with a Teflon RG400 cable. Um, also tidied up the box that houses the DB node adapter and interface board. Um, I've mounted the uh, interface board on the lid um, you would have seen the prototype versions of this uh, in my other videos and uh, that connects down to a header socket arrangement underneath the pick chip. This is a Satoshi 1.01 uh, board, one of the early DB node adapter boards he created. Um, the RJ45 socket on the interface board peeks out through a slot in the back of the uh, box and uh, that's where the radio cables used to exit the box so to accommodate the radios I've uh, mounted some uh, D9 connectors on the back of the box there and uh, that was a much nicer way of doing things and uh, in the middle of the back here you'll see a little box and that is a 5 volt power supply I built up to run the node adapter board from 12 volts this board doesn't have onboard uh, power regulation so uh, that uh, takes care of that one. The other thing I've done is uh, reinstalled the LEDs on the front. Um, because of the way this interface board works, um, I had to change the way the push to talk LED, the transmit LED connects to the circuit. Um, instead of being connected to the picker chip, which is no longer sort of doing any sort of um, I.O., it, uh, it now is driven from the transmit enable line from the interface board. And uh, I ended up giving the box a new paint job as well, got rid of some scratches and made it look nice and neat. And uh, so what we have now is just a single socket in the back which goes off to the ICOM controller. The modem, receiver, transmitter, hey presto, one D-Star repeater, plus of course the, uh, the duplexing and antenna hardware as well. So there you go, this is Michael VK5ZEA. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, I'll see you again soon.